uh, I also had something here on multi-year contracts, because it's something I think we pay too little attention to, multi-year contracts. And you can see, I grabbed some information from NHMA's webpage, which it says um, that specific statutory authority permitting municipalities to enter into multi-year contracts is vested in the legislative body, not the governing body. The legislative body clearly says right there. Yet, we don't often see that actually playing out, do we? So I think we need to probably pay a little bit more attention as a budget committee to um, those uh, errors of omission, shall we call them. Mm. Now, multi-year lease agreements are also considered multi-year contracts right. and are subject to because uh, they're considered long-term debt, like a bond, require a three-fifths majority vote. Now, I'm bringing this up because this is one of the points that I think is going to be brought up this year in the budget session because of Article 13 of 2018 was a five-year lease for two garbage trucks. Okay? Now, this passed you can see it on the bottom by 50.6%. And we're leasing those trucks. Now, as you recall, last year when we reviewed this, it was like we have an escape clause that if it doesn't get funded in the subsequent year, we can get out of the contract without, without cost. Mm -hmm. right? So what this means is you can anticipate seeing another warrant article to appropriate money for the second year in this contract and so forth, okay? One of the problems that, that I see with this is a practical one, is that what if the voters decide not to approve it in year two or three, for example? Now, you know, we have this thing called the no means no law. When the voters say no, that means you can't find some other way of funding that. You can't do it at all. And so if they say no in year three, for example, that means we can't go on these, these, these garbage trucks, so what do we do for garbage trucks? <laughs> so that becomes, you know, a potential operational problem. Um, but you can also see that if they put in a fully sanborinized uh, warrant article here, which would have required a three-fifths vote, it wouldn't have passed and we wouldn't be able to lease them at all. So... That's apparently the give and take. I believe the town manager several years ago actually made mention of, of having to reappropriate money in subsequent years sure, on this. Yeah. So he knew right. at the yeah, time. Yeah, I believe that's the plan that we'll have a similar. Right, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. So I just want to highlight, I'm only highlighting those things which I think are general things to keep in mind as well as things that might come up this year. Mm 